Meanwhile, we go to the charity ride. This is Neil Wood with Chris Neem on a 500cc sidecar. Don't forget, this is all raising uh, money for cancer research. So uh, if you'd like to uh, chuck in a little bit of money and help out Neil Wood here raising money for cancer research, research please do. There we go then, that's the first charity ride then for Neil Wood with Chris Neem on the 500cc sidecar. So that's the youth then in the demo race, uh, won by Freddie Fox Baron, 88.2 seconds for Freddie and obviously uh, Jamie there in second place. So Freddie Fox Baron, 88.2. Taxi ride Neil Wood with Chris Berwick.
So that was the taxi right there, Neil Wood with Chris Berwick. So here comes Ruth Smith, ladies and gents, give her a bit of encouragement. So there she goes then, Ruth Smith, ladies and gents. We now move on to uh, the next taxi ride, and that's Paul Wicello with Mike Palmer. And uh, Paul is sponsored here by his 81-year-old uh, father who uh, rides on the mini track. So that was Paul Wicello with Mike Palmer and the taxi right there. Just a quick note, Paul Wicello, he uh, has actually signed up full time to Grass Track after having the taxi ride as a passenger. He loved the experience so much, so he's going to do it full time from next season. We also have a new fan here today as well, two week old Louise Baker Standing. She's the daughter of Tom and Becky, granddaughter of Jane and Nico, and great granddaughter of Paul Standing. She's the fifth generation of Standings that have attended down here at I Wade.
There we go then, taxi ride with Paul Heath on board with Paul standing. We're going to go back to racing then. One of the busiest men here at the Ivor Thomas Memorial is Neil Wood. Neil is raising money for cancer research. Tell us a little bit about what you've been doing. Well, at the moment I've had four rides. I've been trying to ride on a different machine every time, you know, get experience and obviously do something that's completely different and the effort hopefully gets some money towards cancer research. Well, it is a fantastic effort. Are you enjoying it though? I might, I might tomorrow. At the moment it's, you know, exhaustion and pain, but it's all for a good cause. So, I'm, yeah, I'm enjoying it. What's been the most favourite piece of equipment to ride? Uh, I don't know yet because I've got two to go, so one of those could be my favourite. Um, I've still got a ride on a right-hand side car and a four-valve upright, so I'll, I'll leave the choosing until then, I think. Okay. Thank you very much and good luck. Lovely. Thank you very much. So, first up then, we've got Neil Wood. He's coming out on Sam Towner's Rudge. So there he is, Neil Wood then on Sam Towner's Rudge. Great to see, isn't it, all these old machines that have been lovingly restored. They've had their day racing flat out and uh, they're now seen around the highway circuit in action again. It's great to see. But now we go back to the youth. Freddie Fox Baron and Jamie Etherington.
So first place, uh, Freddie Fox Baron. His time, 83.4 seconds. And uh, second place, obviously, out of the two, was uh, Jamie Etherington. So winning time once again, 83.4. So here we see Ruth Smith out on circuit and she's been uh, giving loads of tuition on the uh, Citra training days. If, you're, uh, if you'll be interested in taking part in the training days, please see Paul or Steve standing after the event today or check out the website for further details. So there she is, Ruth Smith, completing her four laps of demonstration for you. And as we said, she's been receiving tuition at the Citra training days. And uh, you can get further details, as we said, from Paul or Steve standing after the meeting today. So next up for you, Chris Berwick and Steve standing on the left-hander for you. So Chris Berwick, Steve Standing on the left hander, they complete their demonstration ride for you. Having a little meeting over on the centre green, Steve Standing is now talking to Paul Haig and informing him that he's going to have to have a little ride round on a sidecar. A little present from his lovely brother Andy. It looks like we're going to be having a Mike Palmer with Paul Haig. So Paul is from uh, speedwayportal.com, down here filming the event. And as we said earlier on, that's going to be available free on their channel, speedwayportal.com. And if you'd like a DVD of the event, you'll be able to purchase that from the website once this goes live in the, uh, in the next uh, week or so. So number 46, Mike Palmer's out there now, and he's got Paul Haig from speedwayportal.com. He's on the back, he's being told uh, where to lean, how to pull himself. Uh, a bit of a surprise for him, he knew nothing whatsoever about this one, coming into the meeting after driving up from Pool to my way today. So getting stuck in there, leaning off, leaning off the side. Will he stay on, will he fall off? Who knows? 
couple of laps for him to go then of this uh, taxi ride. All for charity down here for Cancer Research UK. No doubt once he comes in he'll probably say, can we have another go? So just one lap, one lap left. Here he goes. Clinging on for dear life on the back. Leaning over very well. Around the final turns for the last time on his taxi ride. So Mike Palmer there taking Paul Haig from speedwayportal.com round. And uh, Paul drove us up here today and he had absolutely no idea he was going to be doing this. So uh, stitched up big time. So we've got another taxi ride now coming up. Helen Shepherd's on with Paul Standing. So Helen Shepherd there on the back with Paul standing. Neil Wood doing his charity ride. He's now going on Steve Cook's Jower and he's going to give us four laps demonstration right there. Don't forget you can still donate to Cancer Research UK. So Neil Wood there on Steve Cook's jar. He's rapidly moving through all the different uh, disciplines. We've got the youth kids. Uh, we've got Freddie Fox Barron yet again and Jamie Etherington. That's it, let him go. Funny trousers, no, your eyes were deceiving you. He didn't touch the tapes.
that's our result then for you there. Freddy Fox Barron, he takes a win from Jamie Etherington and his time is 82.6 seconds, so considerably faster than the last time out, which was 88.2, so great stuff there. So now we see Ruth Smith, she's coming out to do uh, another four laps of demonstration for us. And there we see Ruth Smith then completing her four laps. Don't forget after race 32, our last race of the afternoon, we've got another set of these demonstrations for you. So looking forward to those ones coming up. So here we go on the left hander, Steve Standing and Steve Cook. Been passed a note as well to um, say that Steve Standing is a self-professed superstar, right-hand passenger. So um, there's just one thing missing out there at the moment. Um, so we've just been informed. It's a white sticker with a red L that should be on the back of Steve there whilst he's driving. So there we go then, Steve standing, Steve cooked together, and I think the message there is, Mr. Standing, I think you should remain as a passenger. Okay, another taxi ride then coming up, Helen Shepherd, she's with Dan Berwick on a 500 sidecar. So as we said, some more demonstration rides and taxi rides coming your way after race number 32. 